all right what's up guys welcome back to another amazing video thank you so much for watching on this video i'm gonna be talking about zen we have very important topics to be talking about you know the price where it's heading to where could it head to you know predictions just a bunch of little tiny stuff okay so while we're here while you're already watching go ahead and follow me on twitter it is crypto audit king the link is going to be down below in the description and my telegram is also down below in case you're interested so Zen price under the Ethereum token, um, Ethereum network, I should say, we recently saw a good increase in the price action. We went up about 50-ish percent, give or take. We were just under that one scenario. It was about seven zeros and a nine and a half, I think we saw some, or like eight and a half. Yeah, that's the lowest it went to, right? I'm showing you the four-hour chart. I need you guys to listen up about this, okay? It's super important information, and I need you to grasp it and understand it, okay? So we saw a really nice upward move for Zen. The reason why it went up the 50% in like the very short time period that it did, it was, it was pretty quick. I like it. it was, it's positive for the Zen price. The reason why is because of this. The four hour chart, this one right here, I'm telling you, this 1334 moving average works amazingly. Look how dead accurate this is. You see over, you see like way down here, right? You see here, it's not crossing. We went down. It's not crossing. It touched over here. It got rejected. So we went lower and lower and lower. We almost crossed right here on june 24th or june 22nd my bad but it got rejected and it did not cross okay so that's why we got rejected pretty hard and we started seeing the levels of seven zeros and eight seven zeros and a nine right so we didn't see any good crosses until literally this cross right here this is how important it is this one is what triggered that really good pump up for the token zen i've been telling you i've been literally showing you guys how to set up your technical analysis charting on the trading view side and everything it's, it works guys it really really does i've been saying it for a long time that this 1334 needs to cross in order for it to become bullish as soon as it did we went up in a pretty nice upward move we are recently re uh, going back down and i think we will be retesting where it's at right now which i think it's going to be six zeros in a one one give or take somewhere around there uh so that's where i think it's going to at least hold i would hope so um because it's getting touched right now for the wick side on this red candle right here it's touching the 1334 right now well just just the 13 right now so we need to hold that one one area pretty solid and I love how I know I've had videos saying the bottom is in, you know, this and that. One, I like to do it to trigger the haters and just the footers and and just, you know, I like to troll with them, right? It helps because they, they comment and just hate comments and just create negative comments, right? It helps the algorithm. Go ahead, bring it on through, right? But now, so far, the the bottom bottom is right now, in my opinion, here. And if you were accumulating around this area, great. I'd literally bought $200 worth of Zen at like, not even that far from this price right now. Six zeros and a one, one, somewhere around there. I bought $200. I made a video of it yesterday. And then right before, um, right after I uploaded the video, that's whenever Zen started pumping up. And I was like, nice, that's great. And then I also made fives and Terrions for like, 500 bucks or something like that 600 bucks so it wasn't too bad i mean super cheap centurions right now because guay was like at one point something so super cheap to mint right and so now the rsi did get oversold that's the second reason why we are seeing a pullback this is on the four hour by the way that's why we are seeing the pullback right now this is a very healthy pullback guys don't be scared okay and i sent out a tweet saying guys it's great to see the community posting and saying zen is up let's freaking go you know so on and so forth but let's also be doing that whenever we are here like negative comments hate comments but comments and everything 
let's also be like commenting and and communicating sending out tweets just saying let's go zen keep it up you know stuff like that i was uploading zen content pretty much every single day just saying you know my ideas my strategies predictions everything i was uploading every day from way over here well of course way back then right but throughout this whole entire just constant drop i was still uploading videos knowing i was going to get hated on and knowing i was going to get crazy comments and i was still doing it because i like zen i believe in it you know it's your own personal opinion i respect yours respect mine just how you should and throughout the whole entire time i was uploading and just you know no matter what it price it kept doing i was tweeting out things i was sending youtube comments i was being active on on the telegram chat you know just trying to be positive about everything as much as i could and now that the price is going up that's whenever everybody decides to show up like we need to be both on the whenever it's bad negative terrible sell off and everything and most importantly of course whenever the price is starting to see some price action going upward so i just want to say that man i'm not trying to cause any fud or, or i'm not trying to hate on anybody but i'm just saying we need to be equal on both sides on the down and on the up it helps the zen it helps the community it helps everything all along okay now the last thing i want to point out is that yes this pump is good i wouldn't even consider it a pump just a small little upward momentum um but this is good okay and i've been saying this for months i kid you not i have said it for months we will if you think this little price increase was nice it's it's good for the price right this was a cross on the 1334 moving averages on the four hour chart i've been saying this for months the one i'm waiting for the one i've been saying the most important cross of them all is the weekly the weekly is the only one that will really trigger and signal the absolute bottom look at this that, that four hour was a good cross i'm not going to lie to you guys it was good it was good but that's just the four hour if the four hour did a 50 percent upward move in price think about what the weekly cross on the 1334 can do for the zen price 50 percent will be nothing and my prediction it will be 10 times better than that little tiny 50 percent upward move i'll take the 50 percent though i'm still i'm up on from the tokens that i bought the uh, yesterday or whatever it was so look at this weekly we have not had I, I don't even consider this a cross okay this was just a fake out just a quick one cross and then automatically turned bearish so knocking this one out we have never crossed bullish on the weekly not once okay we tried moving upward we got rejected really hard and that's where we are seeing this we i, I think i was mentioning the weeklies way months ago man saying i'm not going to get excited until we see the weekly 1334 cross and i'm still currently waiting on that so hopefully this four hour cross that it did created that bottom for us to go upward up to like the two ish two and a half scenario that will create some really good curvature for the 13 right now so it can curve um let's see so that way it can curve this way and this 34 will continue going that way and then we cross and once we do it's gonna be a great day okay I, i've said that multiple times that I, that's what i'm waiting for okay and you can go back and recheck me many times as you want to I, I know i've said it okay nothing all the crosses are great but the weekly is the important one okay so guys thank you so much for watching make sure you click the like button subscribe comment down below anything i'll see you tomorrow in the next video take it easy i'm out peace